That's the Lender Institute. Yes. It's summer, summer-ish in Amsterdam. And uh, we're here at the Blender Animation, the new Blender Animation Studio. Yes, there are cars, there are no boats like in the oldest one, but look at this place, it's huge, it's massive. It's pink too. No, it's not pink, it's like orange. So this will be the new Blender Institute. They're still working on stuff inside there. So we are not really working in this place. There's an agent. And there, in the back, if you've seen Tom's video, there, that, that's where the, the new hangout area will be. Yeah, there is a lot of noise, but at least we can hear it now. For the time being, we're not working down here, we are actually working up there. That's where the code quest is happening. So, we use this very <laughs> shady entrance that we're gonna make prettier, but not now. I even had to stop the door with a thing because I don't have the keys yet. We're gonna change the key for safety. And this is the stairs that we use to get in. That will be the entrance to the other part of the Lender Animation Studio. For the time being, we use this. Hey, who's there? I'm just speaking about you. Yeah, really? Okay. Yes, I forgot to invite someone for the meeting. And it's you because you were in the... You forgot me. You forgot me on earth. No, I forgot someone. <laughs> it just happened to be a meeting at noon about uh, workflow. At noon. At noon. Now, actually. Now. Yeah. O'clock. Okay, well, uh, I'll be there then. I guess I get to work. So it's only been a couple of days, but so far it's been quite amazing to see everybody here together. On, on Monday, we mainly set up the computers so everybody was working on their laptop so far so they had to copy some files over to their desktops that are a bit more beefy for compiling blender faster copying everything from my lap every blender things from my laptop to my so after setting all that up you think that now everybody's sitting on their desks coding but <laughs> actually there has been a lot of meetings meetings covering everything like the on Tuesday morning at 10 we got together and say okay what's going on what what is the code quest what is it going to tackle from 2.8 um, the blender 2.8 project is quite big and covers so many areas from like from the dependency graph there is very more technical or OpenGL also very technical to more high level stuff like um, the asset management or the overrides which is mainly for uh, the getting rid of the old proxy system that we used to have in Blender 2.7. More like fun and fancy stuff like Eevee, for example. So all of these topics have to be tackled. So they were split into areas and then each area will have its own meeting with its own team. So not everybody has to be in every meeting, otherwise it would be too long. But we try to be in most of them. The goal by the end of this week is to have a clear roadmap of what to tackle, what is feasible in these three months of the code quest, and what could be left over for after the code quest. Something that maybe developers can work on their own at home without actually the need to be surrounded by other developers. You know, some things are better worked by yourself at home with, their, with your cat on your lap or your dog. <laughs> but it's so exciting to see everybody here together Ton being so involved in the Blender development again after all the open movies and everything. It's so exciting to see everything coming together. So expect more awesomeness. Now we're going to keep uh, planning what's going to be happening. Maybe there will be some mockups coming up soon for especially the, the, the bigger topics such as the workspaces, staff and the toolbar, the top bar and even maybe a status bar. Yeah. So pretty exciting times ahead. Subscribe to this channel if you want to see more. Also, don't forget to check on code.blender.org for updates with everything code quest and Blender 2.8 related. See ya.